Good afternoon and welcome back to another vlog here on Coast of Crazy YouTube channel. You probably did see the title, an afternoon in Bridlington. Yeah, we've come to Yorkshire for, well, technically five days, but we've got four nights um, at an exclusive um, retreat, like a lodge uh, with a hot tub. It's very, very nice. I will do a video of that, a very short video of where we're staying. It was a bargain as well, £386 we paid for four nights and it's stunning, <laughs> it's, re it's really nice, it's near Pocklington. Um, so yeah, the plan is this week, we're just doing a couple of, well I'll say a couple, we're doing a few tourist attractions. Firstly, we've come to Bridlington. Um, there is two little fun parks here, we've got Bayside Fun Park which is in front of me, and you've got the the other one down there, I can't remember what it's called now, um, and that's base. This one, Bayside Fun Park, there's two of them. You've got Bayside Fun Park, anyway, and you've got another one down there, but the one down there is closed. Bayside Fun Park is open, and they've got a go get it cred. Now, I did go to, uh, where did we go? Uh, Canvey Island. Uh, I know the owner there, um, and I did do the go get it there, and posted some pictures. It was quite funny actually because I barely fit in the thing and I just got loads of negative comments and yeah so if anyone's got to be posting negative comments you, you will be banned uh, from any social media content that I post so yeah just bear in mind it is a hobby after all what we do and I will ride any coaster going um, now currently on you got to walk around oh you got to walk around uh, I'm now on 300 what am I on now? I, 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 I got lost every time. Oh, 336 coasters around the world I've been on now. Yeah, so we did Leesburg. I hope you enjoyed the vlogs from there. And uh, yeah, as soon as I landed back in Stansted Airport, we jumped to the car, Lisa picked me up, we jumped to the car, and we went to Canvey Island because there was a go gator there that I needed to get. And uh, yeah, I just wish I never bothered posting any pictures or anything because all you get is. Uh, hateful horrible comments of keyboard warriors that uh, have nothing better to do with their lives anyway <laughs> yeah bayside fun park there's a few rides here we have done this before we've got the caterpillar over there it is midweek out of season um and it was supposed to be nice weather this week but it's not so yeah you got the waltzer there there's a few like small kids rides and things. You've got a Trabant over here. Remember that being like really good. I just need to, adults may ride with their children. All riders must pay. Uh, yeah, I'll wait until this little girl's been on it. It looks like I can fit on this one. So I'll ask if I can get on it and then I'll, uh, I'll get some tokens. So yeah, you've got the gold gator there behind me. We've got a nice helter skelter but yeah this this video is more about us walking around bridlington we've already spent about an hour in the slot slot machine arcades lisa spent about 20 quid on the 2p pushers and um yeah everything else seems to be either closed or covered in seagull poo <laughs> it's just covered everywhere there's like nests on buildings saw a really nice antique shop with a load of scooters in as well so yeah um one token is 50p. Yeah, so they, these your rides. So our roulette is the Trabant, which is there. Yeah, you got the Go Gator over there. Remember this one being really good. But it's not going to be a long vlog, this. Um, I mean, to be honest, I don't really know what else is in Bridlington and there's no atmosphere and there's hardly any, anyone here, really. But you know, you've got a Super Bob as well. And the old school twister there. The Shabant's really cool. I remember, like I said, I remember doing that one. Go Gator, Caterpillar, you got a Dodgems here as well. So yeah, once this finished that cycle, I'll ask if I can get on there. I'll just get tokens for the Go Gator. I'll get me credit. Yeah, shameful cred. Yeah, I will probably film it. Uh, no, I probably won't be posting any pictures because I'm fed up of getting hateful comments off people. I don't see the need for people to be posting stuff like that. You all know what the channel's about. I've been trying to collect every roller coaster in the UK. And after this one, there isn't many more I need to get, to be honest. Um, 
I think there's another gold gate. <laughs> I'll say gold gate. It's mad, and I was, I was in Liseberg just a few days ago, riding Helix and Boulder and Valkyria, and just had an amazing time. And I come back to uh, the UK, and I've got three gold gaiters that I need to ride in a row. It's, it's pretty shameful, like you know what I mean, but. A cred's a cred, a coaster's a coaster, and um, yeah, I'll get on it, it's just stop that cycle now. So I'll ask if I can ride it, and I'll, uh, I'll go and get some tokens, six tokens for this. So what's that, uh, three pound a ride, I think? Uh, not too bad. Right, so I've got my tokens, yeah, it was £3 for uh, six tokens, so it's not too bad, I suppose. I'll get on it quick before there's a massive queue of people and people's, people start laughing at me again. <laughs> the things we do for a hobby, mate, I tell you. Yeah, that's it. Thank you very much. It looks like I'll fit on this one as well. Uh, <laughs> looks like I'll fit on this one as well. Yeah, the one at Canvey Island, I was literally sat on top of it sideways, it was, yeah, it was mad, yeah. <laughs> I'll sit back here, I suppose. Yeah, I actually fit on this one. <laughs> yeah, I didn't, I didn't film the one where we was at uh, Canvey Island, I was literally sat on top of the car, I couldn't believe it. But the owner, uh, Steve, if he's watching, he did say he was a fan of the channel. He said he might cut the bars because these bars here, the, uh, the handlebars, were actually like sideways. So uh, if you're an adult, it, it's, it, no, it's a struggle to get on it. This one's actually quite comfortable, to be honest. It's got a nice little padded seat here. Yes, I know it's only a go gator. I know it's a kid's ride. Yes, I'm like probably the only adult here. But yeah, there's no need for hateful comments, come on, you know. I don't I don't comment on the old posts about stuff. But yeah, so far we've, um, well, we got here and um, yeah, we've just had a nice little walk around. <laughs> got some, uh, got some cockles, wet in the arcades. <laughs> there's actually loads of room in this one. <laughs> <laughs> she's shaking her head at me. As long as she's unput hopeful comments, it's all right. What am I doing? <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> Thing is, as well, because I we keep going around and getting these uh, caterpillars. Emma Davis from uh, Top Thrill Taurus. She's turned into a caterpillar whore. She's like messaging people, but who owns this caterpillar? So it's not just us. <laughs> there you go, coaster credit 637. So yeah, I'm getting there. So there's not many more that I need to get on in the UK now. I've pretty much ridden every coaster, so I'm quite happy with that, yeah. Um, there's not much else here, really, to be honest. It is lovely beaches and stuff here. Again, dogs are not allowed from, what was it, May, May till September. Um, but yeah, we'll probably go and get something to eat now. There's plenty of arcades and things here to have a look around. Last time we came here, we did like a, a jet boat but that's not operating not like it can because the tide's out so <laughs> couldn't even get to it if you wanted to go on it anyway shut up you little noisy yappy dog <laughs> she found another arcade yeah she loves the arcades shut up <laughs> like <laughs> so yeah so you got this arcades everywhere it is really nice here. I, I do like Yorkshire. I don't think we'll be going to York itself. Uh, we're doing Flamingo Land tomorrow. Uh, Thursday, I'm not really sure. Might go to Scarborough. I, I don't really know. I know a few people said go to Haworth, 
because they've got a really nice steam railway there but it's like an hour and a half away from where we're staying we wanted to try and do stuff that was close to where we are so we don't have to travel too far around and i will show you the accommodation where we're staying it's absolutely stunning it's really it's really nice really impressed with it um yeah because it's sort of out of season it was a little bit cheaper than it would have been if we'd gone last week yeah it's just nice to have the time off work really two weeks off it's all right leesburg was amazing helix seven rides in a row did kill me off uh, i couldn't do any more on there but yeah it's really nice We've got the uh pavilion just here they look quite nice in there but like i said you've got another fun park just here i will turn you around in a second but it's all closed up so that might be just a weekend thing and but like a summer and weekend Brid oh bridlington fun park is that one's called yeah there's again dodgems frog hopper they're cleaning it down now a miami wave a waltzer and a fun house that's all in that one yeah so there's two fun parts right next to each other crazy isn't it yeah let's just have a nice walk around really quite like these uh walking around vlogs because you never really know what you're going to see especially if it's somewhere where you've not really been to before i don't really know what else is there's a load of arcades up that way quite a few arcades here actually we wanted to get to it to eat though probably a bag of chips right so we are going to get something to eat we did come in drones earlier to use the toilet and we noticed they do allow dogs in there rather than getting a bag of chips and sitting on the seafront because it's not great it's it's pretty cold we'll sit inside it looks really nice in here it's actually really nice in here i just had a prawn mary roast sauce sandwich and salad and it was lovely really wanted a bit jack of potato actually um but they didn't have any they also didn't have any um cock zero either but yeah it was really nice um I, I do like it in in here it's nice to see old structures like this still being used they also got like a little kids park over there montezuma's not the coaster little play area but that's that's not open either it's a problem in it when you come sort of like out of season midweek there's it's not everything's open all the time but yeah if you want food and that, i highly recommend it. it was really nice was that i don't know what we're doing now i think we're walking back might go to a few arcades and um yeah see what else we can do the weather's not great today though i mean oh, it's freezing cold and the sun's not out we just looked on the weather for York and said it was sunny. I don't know, down here, I suppose. Oh. <laughs> oh. Is it raining? I think it's raining. <laughs> I don't know. It's supposed to be the hottest, hottest day of the year this week. Oh, God, it's miserable, isn't it? Yeah, so I don't really know. I mean, we might nip up to Prim. Primrose Valley which is just up the road they've um, they've got a small little fun park and a little boating lake and stuff there but I don't really know I'll walk back up that way and see if there's some arcades and stuff um, and then you've got Scarborough which isn't far away as well but if the weather's like this there's, there's no point going I just hope it's really nice for Flamingo on tomorrow <laughs> meeting up with a few friends as well which would be good one of them being Darren Ed, uh, Edwards from uh, Adventure Me. Yeah, we could have watched. Yeah, there was a dog there that were a bit scared, I think. Yeah, Afternoon in Bridlington might, they might change the title to um, Two Hours in Bridlington. <laughs> We've got arcades up there. We go that way. <laughs> I don't really know where we're going.
Yeah, so with most seaside towns around the UK, they're uh, really dark. <laughs> That's all I did. So I'm filming myself. Um, yeah, they're full of arcades and it's raining. I can't believe it. It's supposed to be really nice this week. Even my friends were like saying, oh, you'll really enjoy your week off because it's supposed to be really nice this week. It's not, is it? <laughs> There's better weather in Sweden. So yeah, uh, she's um, she's obsessed with two P pushes and um, the Namco Pac-Man Pac machines as well. Well, she, I don't know. She's having a look to see if there's any. Are you see any? Pac-Man? No Pac-Man. So uh, there's plenty of arcades to look at around here. Smells good in here as well. They must do chips and gravy or chips and curry sauce or something. The bowling down there and yeah, I do like a good arcade. There's plenty to choose from here. All right, just come out of uh, Treasure Island. Thankfully, it's not raining now. We're just seeing a sign here for a haunted house and crazy golf. It's closed. Oh, good. Yeah, come walk around our haunted pirate ship. Yeah, I would have done that if it was open. Uh, damn out of season seaside resorts. Yeah, I mean everything else is open. All the ice cream shops are open, the chip shops are open. I mean there's hundreds of them here. I'll take you into the antique shop and show you the scooters as well that are for sale. I think it still is raining, isn't it? It's awful, it's miserable weather. <laughs> really bad. <laughs> oh god. There's the wacky worm going around. Yeah, I, I don't know. I thought it'd be nice, really nice weather this week. Hopefully tomorrow, fingers crossed for tomorrow. Uh, like I said, I'll take you around the uh, the lodge as well and show you that. It's, it's stunning, the hot tub was, it was in that last night. I had to get out, I was actually sweating in it. It's, it's so hot. <laughs> but it's better than this, I suppose, as well. But yeah, there's, there's tons of stuff here. Every seaside resort's got something to, to do, I suppose. Unlike Morecambe. <laughs> Found another one here now. Uh, fabulous Wilson's Amusements. Here in Bridlington. Tell you what you can't beat in the arcade is a good old fashioned claw machine. Uh, I've already put two pound in it. I want to win a, a baby Groot. I don't know if anyone's got uh, Disney Plus, but they've got a very short series. I think there's about five series. They're only on like five or six minutes long, but it's I Am Groot, and I love the one where he like turns, he turns into a little tree. It's well good. So uh, yeah, a pound ago. Four goals. I'm trying to win that one that's there. But as I used to work in an arcade, I know that they're rigged. Um, so it's every sort of very so often, it's all like 30% chance of winning. So yeah. Thing is now it's 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 moved a bit, so I need it. Oh come on! Ah, oh, I've picked it up like six times, and it just keeps dropping it. I didn't go far enough out, that was rubbish that. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> rubbish, <laughs> rubbish. Oh yeah, I got it, I got it. I was about to... No. Okay, Aww. <laughs> Yay! It's a Tilly. He looks like Tilly. <laughs> Who is he? No, mine. 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 Yeah, no, no, no joke. I put about uh, five pound in this machine. I got it. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Baby Groot. Right, so we're pretty much back to where we 
well, we didn't see this bit because I didn't film it. We started up here and had a walk down here and had a look at all the shops. But yeah, I just wanted to show you this, another huge passion of mine. I actually had two scooters back in the day. You got this shop here, antiques and two floors. They got all sorts of retro scooters and just random incredible hulks and yeah, loads of random stuff in here. Scooters for sale. Let's go and have a look in here. Sinclair's. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know how much these are. But yeah, who remembers these? Sinclair C5s. It was actually the first electric sort of thing around. Yeah, there's also old fish fishtail parkers. All the old signs on the top. Yeah, look at all these scooters in here. Oh, there's an old Vespa there. That's like, is that a... No, it's a 50cc, that one, yeah. A couple here, Vespas. Yeah, so I've had one just like this one, actually. Mine was orange. It's actually tattooed on me leg. You can't really see it because it's all faded now. Yeah, so I'm massive into my scooters. There's all motorbikes in here as well. Oh, look at these Lambrettas. Yeah, so these are your Vespers. And you've got Lambrettas. There's three there, that's a nice one. That's like anyone that's watched Quadrophenia. That's like Jimmy's LI150 special. Out of Quadrophenia. So we've got the same side panels on it. Oh, that's nice as that. Really, really nice. Family channel. I don't know if you saw that, but there's some naked ladies on the wall. <laughs> yeah, all Harrington jackets and t shirts, mod stuff. Oh, they're Fred Perry tops. Oh, they're Lambretto, Lambretto polo shirts. £30. Mod shirts and t shirts. Oh, there's another Vespa there. Cool. Yeah, that's stunning, that. Really nice. Oh, I've got to finish up the vlog here from Bridlington. Yeah, it's, it's actually raining again. Um, you got the harbour down here when we actually got here. There was no water in it, <laughs> so it wasn't much of a harbour, really. You do have a beach uh, just down there. I think dogs are allowed on that bit, but the weather is, like, it's not great. You can see it, it's coming in now, the rain. So we might end up just going back to the lodge and chilling out, really, because um, there's not much else we can do. Saying that, it's only 20 past four now. Um, but yeah, if you've enjoyed what you've seen at Bridlington, Come and check it out, come and have a day here, it's alright. It's obviously pick a day where it's nice weather, but uh, yeah, don't forget to uh, comment, like and subscribe. Just there. Uh, hit the notification bell for next time I upload another video. I'll give the video a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. And there'll be more of these afternoons around. We've been doing them for quite a while now. Um, yeah, it's just, a, it's just a nice walk around, show you what's here. We've been in the arcades, I've got a another coaster credit yes it was only a go gator but still a coaster credit and you can get all your fishing tackle and stuff here <laughs> and yeah parking here i didn't realize but yeah i paid for five hours but uh, it's been all right it's just just the weather's not great is it but anyway there you go hope you've enjoyed this one i'll see you in the next one which will be from flamingo land can't wait to get back on sick <laughs> i'll see you again Bye for now.